language, I mean, uh, grammar of Hangul. Uh, the topic of today is uh, uh, the suffix uh, of Hangul. So, uh, first, but so, uh, everyone knows Hangul so much. Uh, this is uh, general uh, information for the um, so Shisha dynasty. Uh, it's located uh, here in the uh, northwest area of China. And this is many cities of Shisha dynasty. And from here, uh, I will start. The Tang language, so as you know well, uh, belongs to the Tibet Burma language group. And uh, it was written uh, Tang script. And the Tang language has uh, unique uh, some features. Are not found uh, I mean, in both uh, old Tibetan and uh, old Burmese. And this is their uh, information uh, on typology. Tangu belongs to so called subject object verb uh, language. And uh, actually, uh, also, the Tangu uh, has so complicated verb uh, rights. In some cases, uh, for example, uh, prefix, uh, including uh, negative, and perfect, and something, and the after then verb stem and auxiliary verb, and pronominal suffix, uh, especially for uh, pronominal uh, for suffix and particle. So, uh, uh, for the presentation today. Uh, I explain uh, just prefix and suffix uh, in Tango language. Uh, so, uh, this is the main verb, I mean, uh, verb stem and auxiliary verb. That consists of uh, the verb uh, phrase. And the uh, prefix and pronoun suffix, in some case, uh, there are uh, some particles. And as you know, well, uh, the prefix are uh, divided into uh, two series. The uh, prefix one, uh, we say, uh, the first series of the prefix, prefixes uh, that indicate the, uh, the direction of the action uh, of motion or perfective uh, so, aspect. And prefix uh, series uh, two, we say prefix two, uh, they can, the second series, uh, it represents uh, the optative uh, mood, uh, mean. Uh, finally, this uh, pronominal suffix, uh, the first and second person and plural, it's a uh, so general opinion. Okay, from here I uh, explain the set of the verb rises. As you know, uh, the uh, Hangut has uh, so several um, the, the kinds of uh, prefixes and uh, 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 the prefix uh, series 1 and 2 uh, generally to say they have the same initials this, and uh, they have some kind of correspondence uh, between uh, both, uh, prefix 1 and 2 uh, so, uh, please uh, remember this uh, prefix uh, one. Uh, I say uh, my, uh, from my deconstruction, uh, it's uh, pre, uh, I say pre. So, this is uh, the real uh, from the real uh, samples. Uh, it means uh, the castle. Case marker, and this is uh, the prefix one, and this is main vowel. Uh, from here, I say uh, the vowels are uh, underlined, and uh, mm, the element in question. Uh, so I emphasize uh, emphasize it uh, by red color. So uh, actually, mm, it's not uh, so easy to decide. The direction of the motion, uh, but here um, probably uh, I suggest uh, this uh, meaning uh, to the speaker. So he went into the castle. And second, of course uh, you know where, but uh, this is uh, 
the, um, the one of the table, a table of the set of independent forms and suffixes uh, of tangled pronominals. So, uh, this independent form, the, uh, the, the sound and characters same uh, for suffix. And uh, so, uh, the, it's divided into first and second and third. And plural, it's uh, not in the individual form uh, for pronomial, but I mean, uh, so, after the noun, uh, this kind of the, the morphine, that means uh, plural, and probably it's uh, corresponded to uh, the suffix uh, after verb. And here, uh, so, um, the, professor, the late professor Nishida Tatsuo, uh, he, um, the, uh, in his proposal, uh, the agent uh, dual, uh, so, uh, some uh, a suffix uh, indicating. So, now, uh, from here, uh, we test, but just we, uh, we show the uh, this kind of the verb agreement. Uh, it's popular uh, to grammatical phenomena in Tibet Bama languages. Uh, for example, first character is the top of the sentence, and uh, the last character is same and same sound. And that means uh, I get uh, Arhat way. And uh, uh, in this sentence, so this kind of the agreement, uh, so independent form, uh, between independent form and uh, uh, so the suffix form. So uh, we return to this uh, tangled morphine uh, qui. Um, actually, it's, uh, it has a various of functions. Uh, first, so I say uh, it uh, it could belongs to uh, prefix series one. I mean uh, direction of action or affirmative, and in some case, in particular compounds, uh, it shows some uh, case markers. Uh, but suffix are making a dual of the agent. Uh, so now uh, we uh, so attest it. Uh, actually, uh, so this morphine uh, in the previous uh, dictionaries, um, I think uh, not mm, quite enough uh, for the explanation uh, for this morphine. Uh, for example, uh, in uh, Professor Kuchanov, uh so through uh, the rubber uh, and grammatical word, it's all. And also in uh, Professor Li uh it's uh, probably uh, same, not uh, enough for um, the, for the explanation. And from here, uh, we use a uh, news uh, for my in the previous uh, reconstruction. Uh, this uh, the large uh, the initial. Uh, I means uh, so mm, the neutral uh, high value. Uh, so it is same uh, as uh, Professor Gong's uh, key and uh, Professor Nishida's uh, key. Uh, here are the samples uh, from uh, given by uh, the late Professor Nishida Tatsuo. So, um, actually, first, uh, I disagreed uh, with his idea. Why? I explained. Uh, so, I analyzed uh, the sample series one, uh, so namely uh, this A and B. Uh, this is a correspondent by what, what, what. So please see uh, this uh, sentence A. The element, the element in uh, question is here. 
Uh, actually, after bar, after bar. But is it suffix? We cannot decide it because here the final the final character means uh, it also bar. And sentence number B is also after bar, after bar. Oh, okay. But why Professor Nishida uh, decided it, uh, the suffix? It's possible. Uh, so as a prefix of the final verb, I think. So um, in this, these cases, uh, so I cannot agree uh, with him. So uh, because we cannot uh, decide it prefix or suffix. Uh, uh, at least uh, in these short samples, uh, we cannot um, explain it. Next. Oh, yeah, probably so. Uh, in C and E, uh, this is the correspondence of the word by word uh, meaning. Yeah, after um, the this underlined uh, by uh, Professor Nishida and the sequence uh, it's um, as a verb phrase of this sentence after verb, uh, yeah, uh, we can observe uh, this element but actually in uh, sentence number C and E uh, so this is uh, my following uh, for the meaning so, uh, Professor Nishida's sample uh, has no agent inside uh, the, uh, these sentences. No, I mean, uh, no subject uh, so appears here. Only, only D, only D uh, we can see, uh, we can observe uh, uh, probably agent or uh, Object. <laughs> yeah, uh, I explained it. Uh, this is the sentence. Uh, so, brother, mother, and uh, so uh, first person singular and plural and case marker. Plurals. Okay, this is a verb verb phrase. Uh, the meaning of this sentence our father and mother should permit us to live a household life. So, uh, this the blue font means subject and this green uh, font are object um, but uh, which pair is uh, dual so we can uh, decide it uh, father and mother a pair and this one so mm, the, but uh, probably uh, in the sentence it means the object uh, in this uh, sentence so mm, the, in my previous expression uh, the samples uh, given by Professor Nishida uh, I think so weak a little uh, but uh, but in my previous work, uh, so uh, I can uh, observe such kind of uh, phenomena. Uh, please see the sentence number three. So uh, in this case, uh, we can observe after verb, after verb, after verb. Uh, so we can observe this element. But um, this sample, uh, this means uh, Avalokiteshvara uh, Sutra. So that was, uh, how to say, rock printed uh, style. And uh, in my previous work, uh, I thought it as uh, a mistake of the arrangement of the rocks. Uh, so, and after then, uh, tried to find uh, any more um, the proper uh, 
from uh, samples for denying the Professor Nishida. Uh, but unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, I found the proper uh, example. Uh, so I, uh, I must uh, I have to apologize to Professor Nishida Sensei. So uh, in this sentence, clearly you can find the two persons uh, inside this simple sentence. So uh, this in this sentence, uh, first two characters meaning uh, so we. Uh, so first singular and plural. As next, the two persons apparently. And after verb, uh, we can find this element. After that, so uh, I analyzed uh, my previous uh, samples. Uh, all cases, the subjects, uh, this kind of, uh, of course, I can find it uh, in the uh, contents, uh, in the text. So um, that uh, we, that we, um, that means uh, two of us. Uh, I think uh, in my previous uh, samples, uh, such as this one. The next one is same. Uh, so uh, this sentence, the sentence uh, without a uh, subject mm, to in uh, this uh, short samples, uh, but actually uh, the, the, the real uh, subject of uh, this mm, the sentence this, uh, is uh, the two of us. So, uh, of course, uh, basically, I think uh, that uh, the elements mm, uh, so shows some kind of the, the dual marker as a dual marker, but uh, we can find uh, so many exceptions actually. For example, please see this uh, number seven. Number seven. Apparently, uh, inside uh, this uh, sentence, Ananda and Rapa, so two persons, but without any kinds of suffix. Why? And please see number eight, two, oh, oh, two, two Buddha, and this Tathagata. This is uh, the su subject of this sentence, two, but without uh, any kinds of suffix. So why? I think uh, in case such as uh, the short or simple sentences, we cannot observe such uh, elements. Here, uh, we return to the original text uh, for example, look, <laughs> it's so long sentence, so long sentence. And here, this is, uh, so this means we, and the main verb, and the suffix. So, I, mm, this is the real sentence uh, from my uh, the previous work, and uh, so, now I show you the first sentence. The first part means at the time the boy and girl say to uh, Sudana. This uh, means boy and girl, two persons. And from here, from here to the end of the, uh, these lines, actually, Actually, they are uh, just inside this conversation. So, we return to uh, our samples. From here to here. So, 
we can observe uh, such um, the sentences uh, including uh, suffix qui inside only conversation. And uh, so, please see, uh, this is uh, my sample uh, number, uh, uh, number four. So, this, this, uh, so we two person, but who, who is uh, two person here? The boy and girls are located uh, so far from here. Um, it, this is uh, my uh, short conclusion. Uh, the suffix uh, this qui appears in not short and uh, simple uh, sentence, but uh, long and complicated uh, sentences. Uh, in which uh, it is not easy to know the subject, um, and uh, mm, I cannot uh, restrict uh, subject uh, because in uh, Professor Nishida's sample, uh, so okay, okay. Uh, uh, sample D. So uh, I think. Uh, these two mm, the subject and object. but in case so uh, we cannot decide on the subject uh, because subject are two persons and uh, I will finish uh, so mm, I think uh, the suffix qui is uh, mm, I think not obligate, uh, just a reminder uh, of the leader. And uh, is it possible uh, from the viewpoint of uh, Tibet Burman languages? Um, some languages in Tibet Burman do have a special expression uh, for this kind of uh, dual uh, persons. Uh, type A is um, by uh, verb suffix uh, as tangut. And uh, type B is a uh, noun suffix uh, or a special form of pronominals. Uh, pronom so, pronominals. So, uh, this is uh, from uh, Professor Nagano uh, Yasuhiko from Japan. Uh, this is uh, uh, Jerome language. And uh, so, please see uh, the first singular and dual and dual. So, mm, so actually, Germanic language uh, so it, uh, shows us some kind of uh, the feature of dual. Uh, so this prefix and suffix, especially uh, please mark this chi, applicate chi. And uh, uh, so this is a real sentence, uh, chi gyo kama. Is it right? <laughs> uh, so, uh, the meaning of this sentence, uh, we, uh, two of us will arrive. So, um, I think uh, this chi is phonetically uh, um, uh, not so far from Tangut Kui uh, because uh, the before the, the E, uh, the Bira. Yeah, good, good. So uh, it's uh, possible to uh, change uh, to the applicate chi uh, from uh, the in front of the uh, central dollars. The next one is, um, I think it's not good uh, samples, but uh, some language has a category uh, dual pronominal forms, uh, including uh, like uh, k morphine. Uh, so, please see, the, this is the pronominals and the real term, uh, nanik, uh, nanik, nanik. So, uh, all uh, the forms of dual of um, pronominals in Atsi language has this kind of the, the ik. Uh, as the dual marker. 
Um, uh, this is the uh, conclusion of the uh, Actually, this uh, key, uh, Max Dua, uh, the agent, and the suffix appears uh, in not short and simple but long get sentences. Uh, and uh, mm, its functions as, uh, I think, uh, just a reminder. Uh, of course, uh, I don't know the old language of Tibet Burma, uh, but uh, actually I mm, think uh, such kind of type of the um, expression for the markers, so uh, I think uh, close to uh, Jeronic uh, languages. Uh, but actually, uh, so uh, we have um, so more future tasks. Uh, actually, the, the material mine is uh, restricted uh, in a Buddhist text. So uh, we can find the, the not uh, Buddhist text. Uh, so this is uh, my the, the future tasks. And uh, of course, you know, uh, inside the Buddhist text, it is uh, so hard to find the dual, dual uh, subject. Uh, you know, uh, bikini and diction. So, but they are not uh, so two persons. Uh, bik and bikini. So, including uh, so the prosperous uh, Buddhist monks and nuns. It means not dual, plurals. Mm. So, uh, anyway, uh, from the context, uh, we can find uh, some kind of the, uh, <laughs> subject, uh, dual or not. And uh, uh, next uh, task is, uh, is it possible uh, the, from the view of the Tibet Burma language so, uh, because uh, I'm so poor at uh, the modern languages, and please uh, give me some uh, <laughs> the example uh, from uh, US. Thank you.